Are you ready? Let's go. Today I will be showing you my Obsidian journaling workflow, uh, where it starts from the day and then to the week, to the month, not to the quarterly, which a lot of people do, but to the thirdly and then the yearly. And the templates for all of these will be down below for free. So let's get it started. Ha. Let us quickly go through what we need for today. We need mainly three uh, three plugins, data view, um, uh, templater, and tracker. You can look at look through my settings, but I think in templater there's nothing really needed to modify except this. And then also, oh, and um, periodic, periodic notes. <laughs> Let's not forget about the most important one, this one. But for data view, you have to enable JavaScript. For the, these three options but yeah that is basically it uh, calendar is also a good addition to it which is this you can basically easily move between the daily notes and weekly notes just by a click of a button but let us begin so when i wake up first thing i do i open my phone and i write down uh, when i slept when i woke up and if i had any dreams i just write them down here and then I release what's on my mind. If there's anything that's that's just floating around my mind, I just release it all in there. So I can have a clear mind in the morning uh, to start working or doing whatever I want. Um, and in here also, this is basically all just reflection and uh, getting to the right mindset and making sure that I'm planning basically for the day and seeing what I wanna do. Because if you don't plan for yourself, life is gonna plan for you. And you don't want that to happen so that's why you do things like a not to do list you make sure that you define what you don't want to do and then just for motivation i tell myself now go conquer the day like a fucking champ and then after i do i go to bed and when i go to bed i just go through this section basically a uh, log is basically there for uh, me to write anything throughout the day any quick reflection, any quick things that I want to remind myself at night while I'm reflecting, I just write it down in here. A uh, story, uh, what's my story of the day? Uh, I just write something cool that I would like to share with my friends later. Uh, same idea in the funny, funny. If there's anything funny that happened, I write it down here. Like for example, I ran over a squirrel while biking to home you know just a typical day average biker day and same thing in song of the day um this actually this is basically how it started this whole thing started with me writing down my song of the day and then i just built on top of that to this <laughs> this empire of questions that i ask myself before i sleep um and then here i just um reflect on my wins and losses for today and then through these i come up with what's the biggest accomplishment that i accomplished today and then i write down the lessons i learned and what can i improve for tomorrow and for the rest of my life and you know these two sections are basically how i got the content for my previous two youtube videos which is the biggest lessons i learned in 2022 so it all starts in here and then from here i take them all into the weekly whatever is like the biggest lessons i learned from the week i compress them into the best in the week and then from that week into the month and from the month into the thirdly which is every four months and then from these thirdly notes i turn them into the yearly note the yearly reflection but let's not get ahead of ourselves let's stay in in here next question i ask is my, what's the what defined my day uh, what was the best thing that happened for me today what was the most unique thing that happened to me today and what inspired me could be a person could be myself could be an event could be a thing could be a anything and then starting from here to the bottom is all uh, rating out of 10 you could rate out of 5 whatever you want I have a friend who religiously believes in rating out of 5 not 10 uh, but whatever fits your vibe as you can see here I have a words per minute rating um because i'm trying to improve my, in my typing speed so 
you can remove that you can replace it by any habits that you're trying to improve on like healthy eating eating uh can like score out of 10 or out of five how healthy are you eating uh and just be creative and do write down whatever track whatever you want to track and i will show you in my weekly note how um we can look at some data using the tracker plugin and then after i finished tracking i asked myself what could i have done better to get higher ratings it's just for me to get into the right mindset to uh, be in reflection mode you can say and then these three questions in here the reason i ask myself why am i amazing um i believe that it's good to end your day in a good note in a positive mindset in a positive vibe because you spend a third to a quarter of your life sleeping so might as well get into it in a positive mindset right and these three questions kind of get me to that positive mindset um so like and also make sure you don't don't make it repetitive don't ask don't respond to the same answer every, all the time the point of this is to get you to find beautiful things within yourself and appreciate these things by being grateful, grateful for them and then the last section is what did i control today um this section is mainly for a reminder to yourself that you are in control even though in this day and age it, there's a lot of things that's hard for you to control um it's out of control but it's good to remind yourselves of the things that you are in control of and these could, things could be as simple as i was able to walk today <laughs> and i was able to go get groceries today i was able to make my own food i'm in control of that i'm in control of what i'm eating i'm in control of how much i'm drinking i can go to the toilet by myself you know these stuff um now let's move to this is basically the template in here that generated this and then now let's also show sure how it looks like in in the reading view so yeah here that's how it looks now let's move to the weekly what it does is basically it gets through this data view query through these data view queries it gets each question that we ask ourselves in here and it puts it all from that week, for example, or week, week 10, for example, it gets all the daily responses that I have and puts them all in the list, in the data view list in here. So for example, here is this one's my songs of the week. Uh, I have this list from here, which came all from six till 12, because that is week 10. This is week 10's file. And then we just write down the song of the week in here. For me, it was Uprising by Muse. At the end also, we have the data section. And this is using the tracker plugin. For me, I have three sections. The overall section, which consists of the uniqueness score and the overall score. And then the feeling section. And then the actions section. And after that, we have the summary section, which basically gets the year's average of the overall score and this week's average of the overall score and this is just for you to compare like was this week uh, an above average in overallness or below average and it's the same thing for all the things we track in here and we also have this sleep which is not working properly here because i started work i started tracking my sleep this week so last week but i didn't have any data to track and it's the same idea in the monthly where it gets all the weekly responses and puts them all into a data view query in the monthly and then there's also in the monthly the the data but now it's not now it's more detailed it's the same concept um relate this month's this month instead not this week's to the year and uh, it's the same thing for the quarterly or the thirdly and then also the yearly if you are interested to know how I built these kinds of, how I built this kind of thing. Um, the internet is filled with information about data view, templater, tracker for these um, uh, charts. Also, one thing to keep in mind, 
I did not build this in all in one day. This took two years to completely fully reach this point. It was not as good as it is as it is right now. Um, but I just, I started simple. It all started from this question, song of the day, kind of. And I just um, built upon that. And whatever insights that I get from other people, uh, I, I see can, how can that relate to my template? How can I add this to my template? For example, this control thing, I did not come up with that by myself. I come up, I came up with that from another YouTuber. I think his name is called Better Ideas. Um, this, I'm amazing because I got this from a book called You Are a Badass. And I was like, why not put that in my night uh, journal? Before I sleep, it's good to it's a good way to remind yourself why you're amazing. You just get inspiration from other people's templates and I hope you found inspiration from my template. Maybe you already have your own. Um, I hope you found something that you could add to your, to your own one from mine. I greatly appreciate you guys sticking to the end of the video. Um, if you want to see how this temp these templates impacted my life and how it could impact yours, uh, you can check out the biggest lessons I learned. Uh, from 2022 because that was all possible through these templates um, if you have any questions related to these templates or suggestions please let me know in the comments and if you found this video useful in any way or form uh, please like and subscribe maybe share it to someone who is who would find this useful and um, yeah have a lovely lovely rest of your day and i hope you guys see me soon goodbye this is hard as fuck, bro.